six green bottles hanging on the wall. Six green bottles hanging on the wall. And if one green bottle should accidentally fall... There'll be five green bottles hanging on the wall. Haunted Hotel, Death Sentence, that's right, we have another Haunted Hotel. This is the beta demo for the game. Uh, I recorded the last Haunted Hotel because it was the first entry made by Elephant Games, and this one was also made by Elephant Games. So anyways, looks pretty cool to me. I am obviously a big fan of Elephant Games, so this was a no-brainer. Why don't we hit the play button and see what this game is all about. So we have our casual, advanced... Hard. And then we do have custom, which is really nice. So that's cool. So I'm going to go ahead and just use their standard casual mode. So this was from the uh, last game. Yeah, that was the last game, right? Ancient Bane? It looks familiar anyways. That is a... envelope that's been around, hasn't If you're it? reading this letter, I have died. The Holy Mountain Hotel has the answers, but it's a dangerous place. I'll find you, James, even if I have to search every inch of this place. Uh, all tutorials, no tutorials. Uh, you know what, we're gonna skip tutorials for this time around. Because, you know what, we'll just, uh, get into that. Oh, look, we have a collectible. Very interesting shape for that collectible. Ooh, hello. Wow, we... <laughs> I guess that metal wasn't very thick. We just bent that up like it was nobody's business. Plus symbol here, so we can go ahead and undo that. Oh, another ring, a rock. I can't bear the thought of you sharing my fate. My friend, be careful. P.S. True genius lies in simplicity. Throw a rock somewhere. Okay, we will definitely consider that. What if we throw the rock here? Yeah. Vandalism. Hey, when you're a detective, vandalism is completely legitimate approach. The Holy Mountain Hotel. Look at the creepy hand there. Wow. I'm like getting the swaying reeds here. It just adds a lot of atmosphere to the game. Alright, well, let's get into this here and see what we have. That's a very interesting perspective for a mermaid. <laughs> Uh, just again, just another fantastic example of amazing Elephant Games artistry here. Like, look at these fish, they look incredible! Just incredible. And yeah, I mean, they do use the same engine, but there's minor tweaks here and there, but I still enjoy all of the Elephant Games. I don't know why, just. Big fan. Big time fan. So we just got an achievement. Find a hidden object puzzle in less than a minute? I don't think we did that one. Alright, anyways, we'll back up. So we have to keep on clicking here. Boil some hot water. Got ourselves a nice binder here. Oh, that kind of real. Clever. Who is this EB mentioned here? Someone who works at the hotel? So that is a triangular key. Which will work on our triangular lock. And here we go. Is 
this hotel looks like it hasn't been open in years. Yeah, it's looking a little bit, uh... Like, even with the clouds and the dead tree over there. Okay, well, that can't be good. <laughs> Someone's inside. I have to get in there. What the heck was that red-eyed thing there? I have to fix the mechanism. Oh, grabbing an electrified magnetic or a magnet is probably not the best idea. Now I would gather that would be bad. Hello, snail. He has his own snail hotel. The shape is missing. I don't think that's the shape we're looking for. Oh, another collectible. So I guess they're kind of green, is that the idea? Wow, this is quite the uh, fancy display here. Interesting. I really hope that was a squirrel. Hey, what if it wasn't? I'll take that ladder and I can't seem to get at that axe. This is all busted, is it? Oh no, we're gonna have to fix it. Uh, shall we go? Oh, no, we're not gonna go inside. I hope that was the wind. Yeah, yeah, no, me too. This place is getting to me. Oh, so we got a couple pieces here. Put this handle back together. I do have glue. Uh, wait, what? Oh, I gotta glue these parts too. Ah, there we go. Handle. Let's open that up with a puzzle. Swap the outer silver plates until they match the outlines of the inner copper shapes. Okay. Wait. I gotta go one by one here? Alright, we'll go one by one. Let's see now. This is, uh... I'm not sure that... No, that doesn't look right either. Oh, I see. I gotta go this way, too. Huh. Okay, so that should work there. Let's just try it. How do I try this thing? I don't know how to try it yet. Because we can't. That might work there. That will not work there. That might work there. So, what do we have here? These are all... Go up there, I think. Okay, so that one should go there. And then this one's roundy. I'm not sure. This actually could take me quite a bit here. Only because I can't move them more than one space at a time. No, that's not it either. Uh, that might be it. That's not it. Oh yeah, that might be that one there. That might be that one there. So I need this one here. Basically... might be this one. Alright, let's flip this one over here and see if we can put this back in position. That looks pretty good. Maybe. Uh, 
Oh, this is wrong here. Let's swap these two. Oh, it actually shows green, which means that one's actually the right one. statue there. That indeed was a scary shadow. A little man, Detective James. We have a little collectible figurines with a nice coffee cup there. Take that hat. Oh gee, that scared me. Haha. <laughs> Startle or what? Another collectible? Looks like they're all made of hammers. Is this the owner of the hotel? I don't know. There are several videotapes hidden inside the hotel. Keep an open mind when viewing them. Remember, evil runs deep. Okay. How do I get that out of there? We have to put the fire out first. Uh, looks like that's a movie projector room. Got to repair the projector. Uh, we just throw that away, or what? That's everything but the new lens and something to play on it. Okay, sounds good. Okay, creepy ball. Oh, I can actually have uh, physics. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm not alone too. Hello. <laughs> I gotta turn on the lights. No such luck. Who is this guy? He's creepy. So what do I How did that even fall? Good question. Take this off of here. Isaac! Figures will fit in the crack. It looks metallic, so we need to get that magnet here. Now, how are we going to do this? Hmm. Let's just use the hint here. Let's go this way. I want to see what we have here for a journal. We haven't looked at this yet. Here's all our notes. We have a dossier here. That's all we have so far. Actually, I don't even think we have a menu. Or, I mean, uh, not a menu. <sighs> a map. Oh, no, we do. Oh, we do. Okay. Oh, and here are all the collectibles. Uh, player. Current task. Oh yeah, that's where we want it to go. Pull this off. Gather up my nails. If only I had something to carry it with. How about a shovel? So I'm not sure how I'm going to get that axe out of there. Alright, fine. Well, well, we can go put the fire out. Let's do that right away. Grab that piece of wood. We still don't have all of the nails that we need. Or the wood. Uh, so we can't use the hammer on that? No. 
So how am I going to deal with this? No, that's not it. Wow. Paw print there. Oh, more nails. And I think we're going to get a board out of this too. There we go. Down play. Make myself my own ladder. Good, good, good. Now let's go back in here. Assume we need a ladder right there. A lens, perfect. What was that? Isaac's diary. It just needs a chain to hook them together. Match the numbers to the outer numbers on the book cover. Press the green button to rotate the circles. Okay. So what we need... to be three, which means that has to be one. Uh, how does this help me? We need to move this one out. So now we have, this one has to be two. So this is kind of weird. Uh, that's got to be three. And I'm right back to where I started from. Arr, curses. Uh, how the heck do I make that one too? I don't even know how I'm going to make that too. So now we got to make that one. This is weird. Like, I find this really weird. Like, how the heck am I supposed to make that one too? Oh, actually, you know what? I think I got it. Two years have passed since the day my patient died. It should have been a routine surgery, but it was all my fault. That trial took everything I had. Despite my reputation, a rich client invited me to the Holy Mountain Hotel. Maybe my life is turning around. There's something about this hotel. I need a drink. Just one. For my nerves. So clearly that one drink was... spiked with something. Totally spiked. Alright, let's see what we got here. Where does this go? Start it up. Isaac Rotenberg, retired surgeon, accused of negligence for performing a complex surgery while under the influence. However, there was not enough evidence for a conviction. Justice must be done, Isaac. You're guilty. Your sentence Intoxication. Oops. It's a tape confession. Could Isaac still be alive, or has this punishment been carried out? Oh wow, it actually spat out paperwork. 
Huh, that's interesting. More stuff from our journal. Alright, let's go here and we should be able to put the stuff that we have here. 1895. Another bag. Isaac's bag. Ooh. Wait, what did it say? It's a chain. Oh, you know what? The chain will work on our little door here. Ah, oh, the, la the ladder just moved to the side. Oh, hello there. Someone's come for dinner. Well, that can't be good. Oh no, I'm too late. It seems this person has been dead for a very long time. There's Isaac Rottenberg. That's our second little trophy. Another little collectible. Battery in there, get that out of there. This cup of tea here is kind of warm. Yeah, that was my thought too. I don't have anything sharp at the moment. Uh, what's down there? We have something lodged in the drain. Well, let's have a look at what he's got going on here. Well, he looks like he's a surgeon. The one drink he had here. He was sentenced to intoxication. That does seem like he was poisoned, yeah. He died last year? Eesh. What the heck was in that drink? We have a small key. That might work here. Let's try it. Rub away. Oh, rust away. <laughs> I thought it was rub away. Ooh, rubber glove. Those are always great for touching live wires. Please, people, don't touch live wires with rubber gloves. It's not a good idea. But in video games, it's okay. You certainly don't want to touch it with anything conductive, that's for sure. Like a piece of metal. So we have ourselves a broken cutter, and we still have a magnet here, which is kind of neat. Let's see if there's anything up here we can touch with our magnet. Looks like we might be able to, I don't know, looks like we still need to figure out that toggle switch. Oh, hello there, little creepy ghost. Uh, good question. So what, what is it that we could do with him? Yeah, the music's creepy too. Although Isaac Rotenberg had quite the criminal record, he certainly did not deserve to die by potassium cyanide for his crimes. Hmm. No, that is not a pleasant way to go. Oh, there's the button. It's magnetic. Good for us. Usually those things are plastic. But this is an old house. It probably needs to be magnetic to make the connection. Toggle the switches in the right order. Ooh. <laughs> Creepy. 